What's up, bro? Day three in Amsterdam. And I got this random idea I wanted to talk about quick, but it's so cold outside. Be careful becoming successful when you're still a loser slash idiot. Something like that, right? I'm going to caption this. I, I had this like glimpse of the ability to become successful for a young person. It's like, it's so normalized now. Like you can become successful within two years, honestly. It's like, just obviously you have to dedicate your life to it. It's not easy or anything, but the time is passing. But you know this time, the time is passing by anyway and you may as well delay or you know that shit, right? So it's up to you right now to become successful. But one thing is that, especially by success, I'm talking about like monetary, I'm talking about building wealth, making money and stuff. Because if you start making money and you're still an idiot, like a lot of people are when they start making money, then you'll become like a magnified idiot. Success and money only kind of magnify, they kind of amplify the person that you are and also reduce the inhibitions that you have does that make sense so when you have when you achieve success and money all of your traits get amplified and your and that sort of social social judgment that you fear you know this idea of like you don't you want to fit in and you don't want to be seen as the outcast and everything that feeling starts to disappear when you start making money this is why you, you'll see like a lot of people who make money almost seemingly turn a little bit crazy they wear like weird clothes you know like like rappers and shit they wear like weird ass fucking clothes and all you know all this shit right because it can give you this feeling of like okay well i don't need to like follow society's norms anymore and make so much money i don't give a fuck i can like, you almost feel like invincible and i'm not at that point yet but i'm certainly feeling like the progress there and that it's it's very freeing but if you haven't developed yourself as a person enough you will find that the opportunities that arise because of success will challenge you and you're probably going to fail that challenge you're so certain right now that I must be talking about someone else. Like, oh yeah, like, you know, like, I'm a bad person. I've been on self-improvement for a few months. I'm the... But it's like, bro, I'm probably talking about you. If you suddenly right now were given like a million pounds, you're certain that, okay, you would be one of the smart ones. We're all certain that we would be one of the smart ones. We'd, we'd invest it wisely. We wouldn't change, you know, I'd just stay the same. We all think that we would stay the same. And of course, the majority of us wouldn't, you would change, you would get like increased levels of like, not increased, but inflated levels of confidence something to think about man if you start becoming successful and you make money like how would your life change because of that i was speaking to some guys yesterday we did like a little meet up in amsterdam and bare people like bare guys came out to see us all that was, it was so fun man it was um literally it didn't even feel real i'm not gonna lie it didn't even feel real that like so many guys were there to like see me and my team but there's like a group of guys like we were all having conversations and at one point this group of guys start asking me about like do i feel very different and like you know i don't seem different they they came to the last meetup and everything and they were thanking me for like being like a normal person not being like a dickhead not being arrogant and stuff and i thought yeah but we, that's because like i was like a normal person i wasn't like that much of an arrogant prick like before i achieved any level of success so you get whatever you are is magnified when you do achieve something and I'm grateful that I, I went through like years of self-improvement, but also years of like struggling and like, you know, graduating with like a shitty dig degree and everything, being like a little drug addict and shit. I'm grateful I went through that first because I, I've been challenged and I've been, and I've grown so much because of those learning lessons. And if I suddenly, if I was like 18, 19 years old and I suddenly like became a YouTuber and make, started making money and stuff, I'd be such a dumbass right now, honestly. So I don't know what your learning lesson is from this. I really just wanted to like highlight this in case you're watching and like, you know, something can click in your brain to think like, if you suddenly became successful, like have some humility and truthfully ask like, what kind of person would you be? Would you suddenly, imagine no one could stop you. No, no one can say anything to you. You've got like unlimited money. Would you turn into like a little bit of a prick? Would you like maybe be ruder to people? Would you become nicer to people? It's like, it's so interesting to see that because if you already have like a good spirit about you before you become successful, one thing I've noticed, this isn't to like jack my own dick off, but I am going to um, acknowledge one of like something I'm proud of about myself. I've became more generous since I've become successful. Like I always used to think to myself, like, you know, I, I wish I had more money so I could like, help people, I could tip more and stuff. And that, you know, you always kind of like, that could have been a cope. That could have been just me like, oh yeah, I'm so I'll like be more generous when I make money. But like, I literally have. And one of my friends, Nabil, he came down from Canada and he said this to me. He said that it was like so beautiful to watch where, where um, we were in a restaurant 
and I like I just tipped the waitress like a fair amount and it was like a nice it was just like a nice gesture and a nice like conversation and everything and he was saying that he wanted to be able to do that <laughs> that was a really fun day man yeah bro it's a good one, actually. because